Good morning, everyone. It's Bernadette Wagner with Prime Time for Women's Mindful Monday. I don't have a guest uh, for today's Mindful Monday session, so I thought I would take some time to share a little reflection. Um, you know, many of you know that uh, I grew up in a family of 11. Uh, there were nine children. The first seven of us were girls, and then the last two were boys. Uh, as I like to say, number three was the best. No, not really. Um, but um, my siblings and I, of course, growing up in a large family, were always vying for uh, the right to be seen and heard. And that's a big part of prime time for women's mission, to give women the choice to be seen and heard. And uh, in our family, of course, we were um, loud and verbose and um, always looking to make sure that our opinions were heard. And that was really, um, you know, a good thing for young girls uh, in the 60s and 70s to um, experience that you could be heard and seen. So, um, it also created an opportunity for us to share lots of our ideas and to disagree and somehow to always manage to um, uh, give each other space to live out their um, views and their ideas. Uh, one of the things I wanted to share is that during this pandemic, there's been this a lack of time for us to get together and to really um, be in each other's company, you know, that intimacy of relationship where you get to, you know, laugh and cry and hug. Uh, that's been missing for us since last February. We haven't gotten together as a family and um, that's been uh, difficult for our family like many, many other families. On top of that, um, the election uh, discussion, the acrimony of uh, this past election has been something that um, a family of um, uh, strongly opinionated people have tried to navigate. Uh, it's been difficult at times. I was just talking with a friend the other day that was talking about uh, the division within her family. And I know that at times my family, uh, as we tried to stay in touch either by phone or text or Zoom, uh, at different times we said, okay, we're just not gonna talk about the election. At other times there was just this desire to try to engage and to understand why people felt the way they did. And, um, you know, uh, it, it was not easy and um, I think that one of the things I wanted to share today is I think that women in our prime are uniquely positioned to be healers. And uh, to, um, I guess because I think women in their prime have lived a little, they've made lots of mistakes, but they've learned from those mistakes. They are resilient because of those mistakes. And I think it gives, um, if you made a couple mistakes, you're more willing to say, I don't know everything, and um, maybe to have a little uh, compassion uh, for others because you've needed compassion for yourself. So anyhow, one of the things I wanted to share today was that uh, one of my sisters, and I don't know which sister, uh, I received this in the mail yesterday. I don't know if you can see it, it says, we are sisters heart to heart. And on it, it has uh, Kathy, Jeannie, Daddy, that's my nickname, Patty, Barbie, Rainy, and Ginger. So um, one of my sisters, I guess it was one of my sisters, uh, anonymously sent this to me and to my other sisters. And um, to me, what that says is that there is this... Um, we are greater together. We can overcome uh, differences and uh, we can find a way to move forward, uh, to heal. And it is my hope that uh, women in their prime do this in their families, do this in their community, and do this in our country. If we put this shared humanity first and we offer compassion, uh, understanding and kindness to others, then I think that um, 
we are well positioned to be the modelers uh, for the rest of the country. So I just wanted to wish everybody a wonderful Mindful Monday and encourage you to, um, as you live out the today and think about the upcoming Thanksgiving holiday, that you give gratitude for those in your life who can show you a pathway towards resilience and shared humanity. So um, happy Mindful Monday and a big shout out to my sisters and I'll see you next time on Mindful Monday. Take care. Bye.